I'm doing so well. They do this. Is this supposed to be like a heart? Oh, that looks wet. Sugar with the dance moves? Say what? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and to another BTS reaction. Today is very fun because we're doing another solos reaction. I know you guys have been waiting for this one for quite some time probably. I did the, so of the solos I've done, I started with um, an August D song which was Dashita. And then I did like a three part episode where I covered Jin's Epiphany, I covered Jungkook's Euphoria, and I covered V Singularity. And then I also did like a Jimin episode where I pretty much died and um, listened to, let me think, what did I listen to? I listened to Lie, I listened to filter and then also I listen to serendipity as well um, so now we're finally getting to the rap line solos today we're gonna be doing uh, love trivia and seesaw so by um, RM J-Hope and Suga so yeah I'm really excited to get into it before we started though, just wanted to give you guys a little bit of like a bias update because I, I love talking about it for some reason. I think it's really fun and uh, I think it's a good time. Uh, so here's my thoughts, my, my life thoughts. Um, I'm obviously, I'm just gonna start off with a disclaimer that I'm obviously OT7 forever. I love them all equally. They're all my boys, you know I, you know I do. So disclaimer. However, I've been thinking about biases a lot. I think it's just an easy topic to distract me when I'm bored, like in my life, when I'm bored, when I'm at work and I'm just like absent-minded, it kind of wanders to my brain. I've thought a lot and I think that obviously Jimin is my bias, but I think I'm wrecked by the other six. But I also want to say, I was thinking about if I have a bias line, like kind of like how they have like the dance line, how they have um, rap line, vocal line, stuff like that. Like, do I have like a bias line? And I've been thinking about it. And I think if I did have a bias line, if I wanted to say that it was my bias line, it would be Jimin, Jin, and Suga, which I don't know if you guys know that I kind of, like obviously Jimin and Jin, from the beginning, Jin was like, Jin was my number one to begin with. And by number one, I mean bias. But then Jimin kind of stole my entire soul and became like kind of like my overall bias. But then lately, I just am feeling like maybe this is just like an ever changing thing that will happen where they just replace each other constantly in my biases because I'm honestly wrecked by all seven constantly. Like V has wrecked me so many times, Jungkook has wrecked me so many times, RM with the lyrics, J-Hope with the dancing, like J-Hope's stage presence live is insane to me. Like I get wrecked by all of them to be honest. But just an update, if I did have a bias line, I think it would be Jimin, Jin, and Suga because there's something about all three of them that just like really like gets to me. Obviously Jimin gets to me on a, like a whole different level where my soul comes out of my body, but like the other two I just find to be like the most adorable little people. <laughs> I don't even know if this is making any sense, but if, it, if you're following me on this, like you're following my train of thought, that's great. <laughs> But I just want to give you an update on my thoughts in general and the fact that I I just I, I feel like Sugar was like a late one for me because I've always appreciated him obviously and love him, of course. But Sugar lately, I just like I'm like, okay, okay, I see you. I do, I do. And we're watching a new song from him today, so I'm really excited. 
Without further ado, I just want to get into this reaction. I'm excited to see some live performances because I know they all kill it live. And yeah, well, I've heard one RM solo song and that was Persona, but I haven't heard any J-Hope solo songs. So I'm really excited for this one and I want to get into it. So we're going to start with Love. All right, so this is Love Live at Wembley. And there's no captions according to my computer. Oh, there are. Make it louder. Sorry. We're starting over. I like RM with this hair color too. I'm ready for it. Yes. It is love. It is love. Sometimes no. Sometimes don't. Bro, he has such a stage presence. <laughs> confident moves RM oh my god look at him let's get a repeat These lyrics. This is a sweet song. Yes, I would be sad, RM. written on the screen. Army. BTS. Is this too army or is this just in general? Alright guys, we're back. Maybe all of you like moms slash wives can relate, but it's a constant in my life that you get interrupted doing literally anything like getting ready in the morning, interrupted, eating breakfast, interrupted, filming a YouTube video interrupted. 
<laughs> but we're gonna continue. We're almost done with RM solo performance. All right, let's go back. Bro, he is going off. Gosh. Is this like a? I meant to ask you guys this. When they do this, is this supposed to be like a heart? Like I noticed that they do this a lot, but I, I don't know what it means. Like a like a like a little heart with your fingers and your thumb. I really like that song. I thought it was very like RM style of rap is very specific, and I noticed he like he does switch it up sometimes, but like you, it's very recognizable. And I feel like that definitely like fit into his style of rap, um, just as a whole. And I thought it was like a nice song. I would listen to it. Um, it probably wouldn't be like my top pick to listen to on the daily. However, I would listen to it like every once in a while. Um, but now we're gonna get into trivia. <laughs> no, we're gonna get into Just Dance, which is by J-Hope. Fingers crossed he's dancing in it because I love watching him dance. Like, it's one of my favorite things. So, let's get into it. What's up, Wobbler? Oh, it's at the Wobbler Stadium again. Yeah. You look good. I just love him. <sighs> like I said, I don't remember if I said it in this video earlier or what, but J Hope makes me so happy. He is literally sunshine in my life. When I'm sad, I will watch compilations of J-Hope doing pretty much anything. It makes me so happy. So, this is making me very happy. He's singing live, there is no doubt about that. Bro, he's so talented, I just can't. I can't even pause it, I gotta watch it. Let's go! He's got such a 
almost like an effortless ability. Bro, he's owning that stage effortlessly. Exactly how I would expect a J-Hope solo to go. Like, happy, upbeat, all those things. <sighs> I feel like I'm in a good mood. I love to see J-Hope dancing around. Like, this makes my soul happy. Hmm. Really is my hope. Anyways, I think we're going to move on to Seesaw with my boy, Sugar. I'm excited. I just love, and I've said this before, I they all three of them have very separate like styles of rap, but I think the one that I'm probably most drawn to naturally is Suga's style of rap. I feel like he just goes so hard. And not that the other two don't, but they go hard in different ways. I think I, I think you guys will understand what I'm meaning when I'm saying this, but like just that their styles are so different and sometimes you might be drawn to a certain one based on their style of rap or whatever, their performance style. And I'm, I really like the way Sugar raps, so I'm really excited to see this. And there's no like comparison here where it's like one is better than the other or anything like that. Just FYI. It's just personal preference. Wow. Oh wait, I don't want to bet. Oh goodness. He looks really good in the red. In the red. Sugar with the dance moves? Say what? Okay. Damn. 
It's an interesting concept for a song. That was kind of a sad one, to be honest. The idea that like the relationship is so up and down that it's like a seesaw, kind of like the the metaphor of it being like a seesaw, and then like eventually he's just like, listen, I'm getting off the seesaw and it's without you, which is kind of sad. Even with like a song like that, which is kind of depressing, it was soothing and I really liked it. I honestly, all three of them, they all kind of fit the mold of what I thought their song solos would sound like, if that makes sense. Like, I definitely thought that RMs would be like kind of deeper lyrics wise. Not that the other two can't write good lyrics because obviously they're both very talented as well, but I feel like when RM even just talks in general, he's very like introspective and like he thinks hard about things that maybe normal people wouldn't think hard about and that's what I love about him. Um, and I feel like his song was very much like that as well. And then same with J-Hope. I thought J-Hope's would probably be upbeat. It would probably be like a dance beat, obviously, because it's called Just Dance. And then I thought that he would probably dance during it, which he did all three, like all of those things. And then Sugars, I didn't know what to expect. That's probably the first like kind of like sad or like down song that I've heard from him, but it did really fit his style of rap as well. It was the style I would expect, but the like concept of it was different than I expected, I guess. So yeah, overall, so we've visited each member's solos so far, which has been really fun. And I'm excited to check out more. Leave recommendations down below, of course, as always. And I will see you guys very soon for another video. Bye, guys.